Who put out a burn notice on Sterling? That would be you. What? Mother burned me? Uh, apparently. Oh, my God. That's classic her. You're both classic her. If me that. Mother, be careful. That crazy thing's got a mind of its own. And it's not the only thing. Why can't you keep it in your pants? Oh, <laughs> oh mother. I've just been reviewing your operations account. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. Come on. Here's a headline. Mallory Archer bankrupt, feckless son to blame. I think for this you're going to need an assist from someone who knows the territory. Who's that, he said, dread creeping into his voice. Oh. Oh, still got it. Thank you, Sterling. And by it, I mean this image burned into my retinas till the end of time. Lucky boy. I think I'll start shopping my memoirs. How does the title Secrets in Silk grab you? Tightly, by my childhood's throat. Nobody has ever said to make this happen, we're going to need a finger. Oh, you'd be surprised. <sighs> For shit's sake, mother! How short is the list of guys you haven't screwed? <gasps> How dare you! You can just forget about that ransom. For once, you're on your own. Mallory will call. She'll haggle over the ransom for you, me, and Riley. No, shut up. We gotta get that phone or something. I don't know. But I don't want mother talking to Bucky. Why not? She's been coming to your rescue since you were in short pants. Ah. 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 Oh, for Sterling, get your things. We're leaving before this quack's office burns to the ground. Uh, uh, uh. Sterling, get your things. We're leaving. Before this cruddy school burns to the ground. Uh, uh, uh. Sterling, get your things. He's gay. I know you didn't plan on this, baby, but Sterling, sometimes the unexpected things can turn out to be the most important things in the whole world. Can't you just dump him on Woodhouse? No, because... That's what I always did. I, I'm sure you did, Mother, but apparently Woodhouse is about to be murdered, so... So are you if you piddle in here. And that goes double for number two, Mr. Man. So you just hold it in. Wow. A ton of stuff just started to make sense to me. The secret is negative reinforcement. Yeah, I'm uh, just getting that. About time. But no, you didn't listen to me. And then you lied to me, and then you almost got everyone killed, and... Almost nothing. I'll kill you all right now. Do you mind? I'm trying to parent. Ah! Ah! Oh, 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 my God. I bet she hasn't cried like that since Prohibition. You little... Ow! Ow! Had me worried sick! Mother! Ow. Stop it! I am gut shot, woman! Sterling, look at me. Now, I don't know what's wrong, but I promise you, whatever it is, we'll fix it. But first, you have to trust us. Oh, no! Suit yourself, Krieger? Yep, yep, yep. No, 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 no! Guess the old gal still got it. All six, right in the ten ring. Right. Just like I taught you, without any help from whoever your father is. Yeah, you were always there for me, which I never really thank you for. Sterling, I don't need thanks. That's what makes me such a wonderful mother. <laughs> Are you kidding? Don't be shitty. Can't we just enjoy the moment? Yeah, how could we not? Ass. The important thing is that you're back and we're together. Um, oh, uh, okay. After all... The real story's always been about you and me. What are you? Which, when you think about it, at its heart, it's really a love story. Please, Mother, don't say that. It's true. Ugh. My dearest Sterling, do you remember what I told you on your first day of training? You probably don't, but it was always know where the exits are. And with all the chaos and confusion of late, I thought it would be wise to make my own exit, in my own time, on my own terms, and in a way that I can never be found by my enemies, or all my lovesick paramours, who are literally countless. Ugh. And so I've decided that it's time to pass the torch. Try not to burn yourselves with it. And I know my decision may seem abrupt, but we don't always get to choose the perfect moment. Take care of yourselves, especially you, my Sterling. Because from wherever I am, I'll be watching over you. Love, Mother. <laughs>